In a plane, a circle is the set of all points equidistant from a given point called the center. You name a circle by its center. Circle P, otherwise known as this circle symbol P, is shown below on the next slide. Congruent circles have congruent radii. Note P is the center of the circle. Segment AB is a diameter of the circle. Segment PC is a radius. And angle APC is a central angle. An arc is a part of a circle. There are three types of arcs, semicircles, major arcs, and minor arcs. Note a semicircle. The definition. A semicircle is an arc that is half of a circle. An example is shown here. Arc RST is a semicircle. In terms of naming, you name a semicircle by its endpoints and another point on the arc. A minor arc. Definition, a minor arc is smaller than a semicircle. For example, in this figure, RS is a minor arc. In terms of naming, you name a minor arc by its endpoints. And finally, a major arc. Its definition, a major arc is larger than a semicircle. An example, in this diagram, RTS is a major arc. In terms of naming, you name a major arc by its endpoints and another point on the arc. Problem one, naming arcs. Part A, what are the minor arcs of circle O? Well, consider the diagram. The minor arcs are arc AD, arc CE, arc AC, and arc DE. Part B, what are the semicircles of circle O? The semicircles of circle O are arc ACE, arc CED, arc EDA, and arc DAC. Part C, what are the major arcs of circle O that contain point A? Well, the major arcs that contain point A are arc ACD, arc CEA, arc EDC, and arc DAE. Your turn, part A. What are the minor arcs of circle A? Part B, what are the semicircles of circle A? And part C, what are the major arcs of circle A that contain point Q?